Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be checking out our new birch box. If they haven't come in yet, so I'm going to do a separate video for that this time. So, uh, for anybody that doesn't know, birch box is a monthly beauty subscription. It is $10 a month. They have a beauty profile that you fill out and they will send you things based on what you say that you are interested in, what you like, and they kind of tailor it to like your skin tone, skin type, hair color, things like that. This month, if I remember right, it was all about hair stuff. So I'm expecting to get a bunch of different hair products. So I've taken the liberty of going ahead and cutting open the outer box because it requires some kind of sharp object and it's safer to just do it when you're paying attention. So this is this month's box. It's quite pretty. I love the pattern on it. Um, each month has a different box, so I guess they're like collectible. You can reuse them for anything. I really do quite enjoy these. They're very pretty. And I plan to use them for many, many things. You can smell... Something in here has a strong scent because like, I could smell it as soon as I opened up the box. So each one comes with a card that tells you like what the theme is. And then on the back, it lists all the products and their description. And it tells you like what they would cost like full size. Um, so let me see. This one says... It's time to eke out every last bit of summer, and for that, you'll need products that don't slow you down. Since there's nothing like uncooperative hair to suck up time and energy, we're doing our part to help. This box includes two hair samples, picked to match your profile, of course, as well as other beauty favorites. Here's to great hair days every day. XOXO Birch Box. So, on the back, it tells me everything that we've gotten and how much it is. So let's see, we'll pick our first random thing, and it is called Balance Me Skin Savers Congested Skin Serum. And it comes in this cute little bottle, and if you read right here, it says it is supposed to be 99% natural, which is always a very good thing. And it happens to be the first thing on here. Full size of this is $30. It says this calming serum fights blemishes, refines pores, and balances the skin without drying it out. Plus, it smells amazing. For anybody that is like me, that either has blemish prone skin, oily skin, um, big pores, you know, this is something that apparently should help. So I will definitely be trying this out. Ooh, smells really good. It's like lemon and mint and rosemary, I think. Yeah, I think it has some rosemary to it. And it smells really, really good. And it's very, very thin. It's pretty fast absorbing. Ah, oh, it still smells good. Kind of, when I rub it in my hand, it kind of smells like a Fruit Loop. So that's pretty interesting. I'll smell fruity. That is pretty nice. Uh, let me see. It says an instant on the spot natural blemish control designed to soothe and reduce both spots and blocked pores to bring skin back into balance. All right. So that's pretty cool. It says it's for all skin types. So that is pretty neat too. Um, let's see. Next thing is a little bottle and it says beauty protector protect and oil. And this is a little bottle right here. Let's see. Let's find it on the card. Uh, it says this customer fave hair oil defends against UV rays, heat, and breakage. Plus it creates serious shine without feeling greasy. I'm going to bet you that this is probably argon oil. That's what it looks like. It smells like vanilla though. I've never had an argon oil smell like vanilla. But it does have that same kind of feel. Anybody that's used argon oil knows that it's like a, a dry oil. It doesn't leave you feeling greasy or anything. And like when you rub it in, it'll give you like some shine and like I like using it on my hair I use it from like about here down because I have very oily scalp so I don't want to get it on my scalp but I will generally take and put it from like here down on all my ends to keep them shiny and from getting super dried out because in order to get my hair to do its full style I have to normally blow dry but I do have to use a flat iron on it neither one of those is necessarily good for your hair so anything that protects it and gives it some shine always a good thing next thing is this tube and it's by Vasanti. I'm if I'm wrong please correct me in the comments 
It says Brighten Up Enzymatic Face Rejuvenator, Exfoliating Cleanser, Enriched with Papaya, Microcrystals, and Aloe. It is this tube here. There's our stuff on the back. It says Dramatically Improve Your Skin's Texture to Reveal Softer, Brighter, and Younger Looking Skin. This powerful exfoliator mimics professional microdermabrasion results using 99% natural ingredients. So we have two things so far that are supposed to be 99% natural. So we're getting all up in the natural this time. It's quite nice. Uh, triple action formula brightens with powerful papaya enzymes to give radiance exfoliates with dermo dermatologist grade microcrystals and gently cleanses with aloe vera, coconut, and panthenol. So you have aloe vera, you have coconut, coconut oil, are both going to soothe your skin and moisturize it really well. You have your papaya enzymes to help brighten it and exfoliate without having to like rough your skin up too much. And you got your little microcrystals, they're going to give you your kind of gritty texture that's going to help exfoliate and get that dead skin off. Um, now it says wash face, massage all over in a circular motion. Avoid the eye area because it's very like thin skin up here. You don't want to microderm that stuff. Rinse clean. Use three to five times a week. Perfect for all skin types. Paraben free, sulfate free, 99% natural and vegan friendly. So all of our vegan friends out there, feel free to get some of this. It says, that, oh sorry, a full size of this little bad boy right here is 28 bucks. The full size of this one is da, 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 $34. And it's, this one comes with 0.7 ounces. You get almost a whole lot, almost as much as you would like foundation. So that one is going to be one to try. I do like my exfoliating. It's really nice to help kind of brighten the skin up, make everything look youthful and nice. Now unfortunately I do have oily skin, so we'll see. I don't know how it's going to react to having aloe vera and coconut on my face because usually I just moisturize with a little bit of coconut oil. So we'll see. Hopefully no breakouts. Um, the next thing we're going to go with is our second hair product. This is by uh, Arm Company Badlands Dry Shampoo Paste. It is no deal. Uh, go on, focus. Now, camera, this is going to be a complete butthead and not want to focus. Uh, this is 0.25 ounces. You get a quarter of an ounce in this thing. It feels kind of heavy though. Um, full size of this is $28. It says upgrade your second day hair look with this paste formulated with Hawaiian volcanic ash that keeps your scalp clean and balanced. Plus, zeolite powder absorbs excess oil. Alright, so apparently that's what's in here. We have ash and zeolite powder. Uh, as you can see, it is this like gray, cream colored pasty stuff. I'm gonna stick my finger down here and get a little bit. Okay, I mean, it's fairly soft. Let's see. I'm gonna take, uh, I'm just gonna kind of rub it between my fingers and see what it does. Uh, okay. So it gets very powdery very quickly. Like, you can't really see, you can see a little bit of my fingers, but it just turns to a powder. That's why I assume you're just gonna, like, kind of rub it onto your scalp. Which, for those of us with dark hair, might save us having the, you know, whole gray look going on in your roots that uh, we get the joy of having with dry shampoo and ooh it smells really good. It smells like peonies. Or at least that's why it makes me think of the peonies. But for those of us that have dark colored hair, when you try to use dry shampoo it always makes your roots or wherever you spray a gray color because they're like powder. And if you don't get it rubbed in really really well or like brush it through really good, you end up with this like funky gray, dull looking root thing on it, doesn't, doesn't work very well. So this, since you gotta rub it between your fingers and make it powdery, and then you can just kind of rub it straight to your scalp, that might help prevent that. So I am definitely gonna be taking this stuff and trying it out a lot. Like I'm gonna be going on vacation at the end of the month, so I'm sure I'm probably gonna need some dry shampoo and some, you know, random small stuff. So this stuff will probably all go with me and definitely get used up. Um, we have one more thing in our box, if my glasses don't fall down, and it is the only actual, like, makeup product in this one, and it is by Manicadar Cosmetics, and it is the part of the Daydream palette. Uh, full-size palette is $25, and this is a rich pearlized shadow, comes as part of a universally flattering palette. 
Um, it says, for an extra glow, you can sweep it across cheeks as a highlighter and a blush. So, see, da -da. and you can, ha, huh, look at that, you can see what I'm doing camera-wise. Huh? Okay, so it's this kind of, like, dusky gold color. Open. I'm, for real, sitting here arguing with how to open up this eyeshadow palette. Ah, come on. You know, if things ever just went completely the way I wanted them to, I wouldn't know what to do with my life. Let's try it. There you go. Yeah, there you go. It kind of almost looks like a shimmery version of what's on the walls back here. Which, by the way, yes, the walls are pink and the ceiling is purple because the there was a little girl that was staying in this room a while back and we just haven't had a chance to repaint it. But, yeah. So it's, it's actually a really pretty color. It's very shimmery. It feels very soft, very velvety. You can see it has a good shimmer going on. Ooh, yeah, it's so pretty. And if I could only ever, like, actually get stuff to cooperate. There you go. So, ooh, yeah, all that shine. So this, I think, is going to be, like, a really pretty eyeshadow or... Like highlight, I don't think there's enough light in here for you to really be able to see a highlight going on. I need better light. But this is a really pretty color. I uh, definitely am going to try to use this. Um, so that is everything in our box this time. We have a total of uh, six, eight. we're looking at about $140 worth of products here. So for 10 bucks, that's damn good worth it. You know, granted, none of these are full size, except probably this guy. But I'm definitely going to enjoy it. I think Birchbox did really well this time. I'm going to use everything in here, um, and I'm probably going to use it a lot. So if anybody else got any of these same products or got anything different in their Birchbox this month, Feel free to let me know down in the comments below if you've tried any of this stuff and you have any tips or suggestions. Go ahead and put it in the comments down below as well and let me know. Uh, if you haven't already subscribed, please do hit that subscribe button down below. Make sure you like the video and join our little family. And I hope everybody has a great day. I'm going to go enjoy this not insanely hot Tennessee day. So I hope everybody has a great weekend. I send you much love from Tennessee. I hope to see you again soon. Bye-bye.